There for three mile hurdlers, Ansem 20 to 1, Richard Johnson, Derry Moyle 20 to 1, Shane Broderick, Ealing Corp 100 to 1, Barry Fenton, Escarta Feig 92, David Bridgewater, Karshi 14 to 1, Jamie Osborne, Ocean Hawk Blinker today 6 to 1, Carl Llewellyn rides, Ocean Hawk Blinker for the first time in public today. Paddy's return has worn blinkers before, he's 20 to 1, Richard Hughes, Pribwell running here for the second time of the meeting, in fact it's the second time he's run twice at a festival, 8 to 1, Tony McCoy rides, So Rab 25 to 1, Chris Ward, the blinkered Tars Bridges 33 to 1 for Jamie McGee. Top spins 66 to 1 for Timmy Murphy. Top spins quite a festival regular. Tragic Heroes Blinkham 33 to 1 chance. And note Norman Williamson does ride. Number 13 is Train Glot at 6 to 1, which had done Woody. 14 are a bandy 6 to 1. Charlie Swan, Wisley Wonder is 66 to 1. David Walsh. Conquering leader 7 to 1. Mick Fitzgerald. And what a question is 6 to 1. Conor O'Dwyer. That's Prince Stairs Hurdle and Escada Feet, the 92 favourite. Ocean Hawk and Train Glot here are bandy. And what a question all at 6 to 1. Conquering leader at 7s. Money for Pridwell from 10 to 1 to 8 to 1. Kashi at 14 to 1. And then on 20s, Derry Moyle, Anzum and Paddy's return. 25 to 1 bar. And Pridwell, sometimes a reluctant starter, has jumped away with them. So Rab was rather slow to stride. Kashi right up there early as they race slightly downhill towards the first of 12 flights. And the confirmed front runner, Ocean Hawk, is going to take off and land with a pretty good lead over the first. They set off pretty quickly. It's second, Tiles Bridge towards the inside. Wisley Wonder in a spotted sleeve jacket is right there, too. And these are followed then by. Derry Moyle and Yura Bandy is close up. Kashi on the inside in the blue jacket as they take the next and the faller there. A faller back in the field. It could have been Yura Bandy that went there. Yes, yes it was Yura Bandy the faller at the second and the jockey there up on his feet. OK, Charlie Swan. Meanwhile, they're over the third at which Sorab was the last to land. Kashi is now taking on Ocean Hawk. In third then is Tars Bridge as they begin to climb on the far side and head towards flight number four. Ocean Hawk trying to shrug off Kashi's attentions. Tars Bridge in third, then Anzum, followed by Wisley Wonder. What a question, the mare towards the wide outside, followed by Derry Moyle and conquering leader as they take another. Back in the field to top spin and then Pridwell, and then back on the inside is Escarta Feig, who's not got too many behind at the moment. They include Paddy's return, as they make their way to the top of the hill. It's Ocean Hawk narrowly to Kashi, then Tars Bridge, Anzum is next, and then Wisley Wonder, and they'll soon be racing downhill towards flight number five. Arabandi and Charlie Swan on their feet uh, very quickly indeed as they go through the first mile, then in this uh, bonus Prince Deus hurdle, and a little bit of a cruise on here coming down towards flight number five. With Ocean Hawk leading, to Kashi the inside, Kashi and Ocean Hawk one and two, Tars Bridge in three. And they continue the descent, settling in four is Anzum, and then Wisley Wonder with the spotted sleeves. The pink jacket with the cherry hearts on the outside, that's uh, what a question. And uh, this is flight number five, over which Kashi has got the inside uh, run. Jamie Osborne, look at him, on the inside yet again. Two in second place, Ocean Hawk, these are one and two, making the turn into the home straight. And what a staring straight it is. Tars Bridges sitting in third, and then the Wisley Wonder four, and what a question, five, and Anson the inside six, and then Derry Moyle showing in seven. Paddy's return getting a little bit closer. Pridwell is uh, still well down the pack at this stage. Top spin is one of the back markers now, started to struggle. Come down towards flight number six, and this will be the last next time where that is Kashi that shows the way. And uh, crashing through the wing there, quite dramatic, that uh, tragic hero, all but run out. Come down past the stands then, and as they do so, it's Kashi leading to Ocean Hawk and Tars Bridge. Then the conquering leader has made a giant to ground through on the inside, a share of third place, a fourth place with Derry Moyle and what a question, then Anzum and then Wisley Wonder. There's the horse, so that's a tragic hero. He's okay, didn't like the thought of jumping that fence. They've completed the circuit, tops but is tailing off. The slow starter, Sorab, is still out the back. The rank outside of Eagle in court holds no chances whatsoever. And Train Glot is at the back of the main pack, but they race away out into the country yet again. And Norman Williamson, successful in the first race, will be very grateful for the plastic rails approaching that hurdle there, otherwise he could be very badly injured. Meanwhile, a faller conquering leader at the next is down there at flight number seven. Tars Bridge has taken over from the improved Paddy's return. The rider's up uh, from conquering leader Mick Fitzgerald. He's OK. In third is what a question. Kashi landed in fourth. Derry Moyle is next. Escarta Feig now pulled to the outside. Black and white jacket improving towards the leaders under David Bridgewater as they continue in the back straight. Ocean Hall is back pedalling. Fridwell is being pushed along to try and improve. Wisley Wonder has lost its position as they now race onto the far side of the course and it's Paddy's return. Winner of the Triumph Hurdle 12 months
months ago, followed by the Grey Tiles Bridge. Escarta Fig is beginning to look very dangerous. An ominous sight, the white-faced horse left of picture, followed by the mare Water Question in fourth. Then Kashi and Derry Moyle as they land over the next. Paddy's return in front, but is he a sitting duck to Escarta Fig, who's looking a big danger? An anxious look round there by Richard Hughes on Paddy's return to see David Bridgewater with his hands full on Escarta Fig. They're at the top of the hill. These two have pulled well clear of Tiles Bridge, then Kashi, Derry Moyle, and what a question. And this is Escarta Fig seemingly taking one stride to Paddy's returns too. What a giant horse he is, Escarta Fig. Coming the down then, uh, downhill, down towards the second from home, and Escada Fig has shot on, he's gone clear, never really got the ground he wanted, Escada Fig, for two years, but it's uh, Escada Fig in the league, Escada Fig for David Nicholson, uh, looking possibly at his uh, 17th uh, festival winner. If Escada Fig is to triumphant, this is two out, he takes it well, Paddy's return, but Karsh is in third, trying to get a little bit closer, So Rab has come from the back, that's uh, the one that's finishing, and Paddy's return has come back for more, Paddy's return takes up the running, did he go too soon on Escada Fig they make the final turn uphill to the line and don't rule out Kashi in the blue and white striped sleeves they've got one more final hurdles to take in the bonus print stairs orange cap is Paddy's return black and white colors Escada Fig but coming there between the pair is Kashi and Jamie Osborne it's a race of three as they come down towards a final flight and it's Paddy's return but here goes Kashi in the lead at the last Kashi leaped it in the lead Paddy's return in second Escada Fig has hit a wall in in third as they race up towards the line it's Kashi in the lead Ansem is picking up well from the back but it's Kashi in the lead for Henrietta Knight Lord Vesti and Jamie Osborne as they race up towards the line Kashi's going to take it really flying at the finish in Ansem that'll finish second but it's Kashi who wins it Kashi takes it Ansem is second then uh, Paddy's return third is Garda Vig in four so Ram five what a question six training lot safe in seven and then came Primble eight Tiles Bridge nine Derry Moyle in front of Ealing Court, top spin didn't finish last. That uh, sad state goes to Wisley Wonder. And so Kashi has won this, the bonus Prince Stairs, the championship race uh, for three mile hurdlers. The older generation, and it's number five, Kashi. And the colours are the race course chairman, Lord Vesti. There'll be some whooping and hollering tonight. Uh, this one, uh, ridden by Jamie Osborne, gave up the inside to nobody. His 103rd winner of the season, his 11th at the festival. And this is a 20 to 1 chance, this uh, Kashi. And the first winner at the festival for Henrietta Knight. Well done to their team. Horses are really firing. Brave performance, this. When we watch the replay, look where Anzim is in the, uh, well, with a quarter of a mile to go. A long, long way off the pack in the colours of the Old Foresters partnership. David Nicholson train and Richard Johnson rode. The third horse home was number seven. Paddy's return. What a brave horse he is. But we're looking at our winner. This is Kashi. Tote returns. Kashi paid £26.90 for a win on the tote. Places £6, six seventy, and four forty. Dual forecast £219.60. 17.